Hello everyone, this is Sheila. Again, I'm back with another tutorial. I'm going to show how to do this pattern here, which is on this baby blanket here. And this is a baby blanket I'm doing for a friend and it's going to be posted away. So I'm having to do this tutorial now, quick. Well, when I did this, um, I put it up on my other channel showing what I had um, done. And I've had quite a few comments asking what the pattern actually was and it's a very simple pattern and i knitted this i made it chunky i used two strands of um double knitting to do it but i'm going to show how to do this in double knitting because um it's just a sample so it'll be like a little miniature one but this one here i started off with this the part down here i had um I actually had 92 stitches on and I did six rows of garter stitch and then this pattern here and I did three stitches of garter stitch on each side here of the um, the blanket and did the pattern in the middle. So I'm going to show how to do how I did this. I'll get some wool off. Blow the picture up a little bit. So it's just a simple knit and purl pattern and I started off on the actual blanket was knit three and you must have an even number of stitches for this to um to come out and I'm going to start off with purl two and knit two Pull two, knit two, and I'm just going to do that until I get to the end of the row, and I'll come back when I get that far. And I'm now at the end of the row, and I have three stitches left, and I'm going to knit those three stitches. That is the got a stitch board out of the sides of the um, the blanket. And that's all it is across the row, is knit two, purl two, knit two, purl two, knit three at the start, and knit three at the end. And the next row is exactly the same. It's one, two, three, knit, and then do two, do the, follow the pattern that you've actually got, where it's purl, do, purl, and where it's knit, do, knit. So it's two, purl. Two knit, two purl, two knit, until you get to the last three stitches. Now I'll catch up then. And again onto the last three stitches, knit those three stitches. So that is two rows you've done. The same. Now we're going to start the next two rows. This is a four row pattern. So you're going to knit three and your next stitch, two stitches, they are purled, so you're going to knit over those two. And the next two stitches are knit, so you're going to purl over those. And that's all it is, is knit and purl over the row. Now I'll we'll catch you at the end of that row. And again, the last three stitches are knit three. And the next row, the same again. Knit three, and we're starting off with knit two because we've already done one row of this, and purl two, knit two, 
Boom two. Now we'll catch up with you at the end of that row. And on the last three stitches, I knit three. And it doesn't matter whether you you end with knit or purl. You always do three knit at the end, at the start and at the end of the um, the row. And that is all it is to that pattern. It's four rows to the um, the pattern. Two rows of knit two, purl two. And then two rows of purl two, knit two. With three stitches, knit stitches at each side of the blanket. And start off with six rows. There's 92 stitches and you start off with six rows. Go to stitch, do the pattern until you get to 30 inches. And then... Well, 29 inches, leave the last inch for the six rows of garter stitch. And it'll measure 30 inches when you're um, finished. And that's all it is to that pattern. It's a very simple and easy pattern. And it's a nice pattern for to put on little baby cardigans and things like that. So, if you like my video, thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll show you another one sometime. So, bye for now.